Okay, so I was doing my daily check to see if Replay had released on 1.28 uh, and I came onto GitHub here and I noticed this uh, Get V51 Custom Types Fix button. Um, I did a little research, um, mainly asking on Discord, so a big shout out to the people over there that helped me figure this out. Um, but basically you click this um, and it downloads this Custom Types Patched uh, QMod file um, and what you'll need to do is at the moment you can't use BMBF to install this um, it just throws up an error message so you'll need to download quest patcher which I've already done um, so if you come over to here on github uh, there's Laurie the fish um, has updated this so it fixed installing modded apk on v51 um, if you haven't used Quest Patcher before, like I haven't, so thanks again for the people on Discord for quickly running me through how this all works. Um, you just scroll down and there's a Quest Patcher download for all different versions, Mac, Ubuntu, Windows, etc. So assuming you're on Windows, you download the Quest Patcher. Um, once you run that um, and open it up, um, you won't be on this page straight away. Um, it'll pop up with a little window. Uh, I think it defaults to patching gorilla tag. Um, also, you obviously need to connect your quest first to your computer before you do this, or it'll just say not recognized or can't see the device. Um, and you will also have to click allow inside the headset, but that's the same with anything like this usually. Um, so once you've clicked allow inside the headset, There'll be a pop-up window, uh, change the drop-down menu that appears from Gorilla Tag to uh, Beat Saber. There's only about 10 things in the menu, so it's really easy to find. Um, and once that's done, you'll come up on this page and it'll just be blank. Um, and all you do then is uh, you get this the file you've downloaded here. Um, where are we, sorry? Uh, you click Browse, click the file, and it installs it. That's it. You can see I've already done it here. So all it's doing is updating this custom types um, file. Uh, so it's version 0 0.15.23. Um, then after that, if you go into BMBF in the headset um, and try it, try to look at your mods, uh, it'll come up with a little pop-up message that says um, core mods out of date or old core mods or something um, you just want to click on the button there that says use old core mods because I think all, all BMBF is doing because BMBF doesn't recognize this file it thinks it's an old core mod um, so if you do open BMBF just make sure you don't click um, update because I think BMBF will then update it to the core mod that doesn't work <laughs> So yeah, this isn't an old core mod, it's just BMBF sees it as such. So at the moment you can't do this with BMBF because um, it doesn't recognize the file. You have to use Quest Patcher here. On the plus side, I've never used Quest Patcher, but this is really simple. I, I, you can literally just click browse, select all your mods, and it just installs them. So yeah, pretty simple. Um, but I've checked this and in BMBF now, once I've clicked use old core mods, um, the version number matches, so I'm assuming everything's working fine and you can re-enable your Wi-Fi connection and stop worrying about this. Uh, so yeah, I just wanted to get this quick update out so people could just get on with their lives basically. So yeah, thanks. Hey guys, as always, thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. Feel free to comment below if you have any questions and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.